Capoeira, a form of martial art and dance from Brazil, is uniting the young in Israel. From Bnei Brak, an ultra-Orthodox city, just east of Tel Aviv to Tivon and Kalmiel in Israel's Upper Galilee. Capoeira is the language that allows these children to see beyond social stereotypes and come together to the sounds of Afro-Brazilian music. Capoeira knows no boundaries in terms of geography, nor age, or gender. Israel is one of the first countries that developed the Abada Capoeira Association outside of Brazil. It is with thanks to the social investment fund IVN that these children are able to forget their daily problems, express themselves, open up, and understand each other physically and culturally. IVN is in a social impact organization that invests and mentor uh, social business uh, ventures like Haridim uh, Laketsev, which is a venture that uh, uh, mentor uh, kids, uh, especially youth at risk, from the Arab Association and from the uh, Haredi uh, Association. A rainy morning on Jaffa's port was forgotten when Jewish and Arab children combined self-defense, acrobatic moves, and dance, creating a visual spectacle. They're new pupils. Some of them speak Hebrew, some of them don't. But they still manage to connect with each other. If you'd asked me a few years ago, I'd have said it wasn't widespread. But now we have started a revolution in the ultra-Orthodox sector. Abada Capoeira Israel and Haradim Laketsef enable a creation of a common language and friendships that perhaps would not have been created in any other framework. I see it as a good thing, Jews and Arabs training, it's a good thing. I immediately knew it was good. I didn't see anything bad in it at all. I had no doubts about doing it. Today, the Abada Capoeira School reaches all social classes in Israel, a Brazilian association of capoeira that exists in 30 countries worldwide. It is through such activities that boundaries are broken and borders are crossed. Lottie Bielen, I-24 News.